right, this is what we do for a living. Ah. Yeah, you guys should touch down near the rear of the carrier. Looks like there's less activity there. Over and out. Ah. Ah. Oh. Just stay out of each other's hair and get this thing done. No problem, fucko. <laughs> fucko? Who says that? Yeah. 
up to the bridge. Over and out. Rios declined. We're heading towards the control tower. Please advise of your position. Over. I'll advise you to stay the hell away from me, if you know what's good for you. Hey, Alice, what's up with Clyde? He went below decks for some reason. Clyde reports directly to Dalton. Whatever he's doing is not your business or mine. If you need something from him, let me know, and I'll contact Dalton. Otherwise, you know your orders. Over and out. What you're saying is... 
are you guys doing? Who's that guy? Both of you are fucking dead. What the hell was Clyde doing? He was helping the enemy, that's what he was doing. I told you to mind your own fucking business.
I thought someone was leaking U.S. troop positions to our enemies? Well, Section 8 hacked into the drive we found, and he says it was Clyde. That drive is full of troop positions and transaction records with terrorists and enemies. situation here. The ship's loaded up with stolen nuclear warheads. They're controlling the ship and they've booby-trapped the engine room. Try and get in there and she'll blow quicker than a tie hooker. And we're on a collision course for downtown Manila. You've got to be shitting me. I'm a Navy captain. Bullshitting ain't in my job description. Now listen. The Navy SEALs are on their way, but we can't wait. I need you to help me bring this ship to the bottom before she reaches Manila. Of course. We'll do it. Good. I'll take the elevators down to Hangar B. Pass through that hangar to Hangar C. I'll give you further instructions over the radio. And, uh, good luck. Seems like today, luck just ain't in our job description. What the hell is going on? Why did you leave the captain on the bridge? He was hurt. Over. This thing's turned into a real nightmare. The captain says there's nuclear weapons on board and we can't control the engine. We gotta help him bring the ship down before we reach Manila. What? What are you gonna do? We're working with the captain. We'll take care of it. Then we'll head back to the bridge and get him out of here. Over. SEALs saving the day. Shit, bro. That's fucking Pedro. Clyde did this. He killed Pedro, and uh, he killed Eisenhower. Eisenhower uh, died in Iraq. You saw him die. Clyde leaked those troop positions. He's responsible for what happened to Eisenhower. Pedro, man! Eisenhower? They were the only ones left from our Ranger squad. I can't believe it! just entered Hangar B. Over. Well, hurry the hell up. Where are those Navy SEALs? They're up. They're dead, sir. Oh, shit. Well, isn't that just great? That means you're our only hope. You two get shot or screw this up and there's a lot of people gonna die. Over. I'll try not to, sir. Over. Cowboy, you in Hangar C yet? Over. The door between the hangars is closed. There's no way through. and be able to open the doors. Wait, shit, that looks like the panel up there. I can't believe you were right. Oh, Salem, step jump, over here. I'll help you up. Let me help you up.
Captain Harris. We're in Hangar C. Please advise. Okay. You need to load as much ordnance as you can onto the elevator platform on the floor. Don't waste your time with the little stuff. 158s, Mark 84s, GBU 28s. Now when they're all piled up, let me know and I'll lower the elevator down and we'll detonate. Okay, we'll call you when the explosives are on the platform. Over and out. see now. We don't know if Klein is operating alone, and if he's not, they know we know. Would you quit this shit already? I'm sure Klein was just trying to make a few extra bucks. It's not some grand conspiracy. I don't know, man. I just don't know. Private military contractors. The very same private contractors you put in power with your bill to privatize the military. You want to replace a military which has safeguarded our country for 240 years with corporations who profit from war. Richard, you know as well as I do that it's not about what I want. Elliot, where the hell are you? It's about what the American Hello, people Hello, are you want. listening to me? Can I help? Call you right back. American people want to end this war. It's about time you got here. And when they go to the polls this November, they'll vote for the only military that can do that. The private military. Senator Whitehorse, this bill will pass. Over my dead body, it will. 
I I'm sorry, we need to take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back with Senators Richter and Whitehorse debating the bill to privatize... Murray wants us to do another mission. What? You said you wouldn't talk to her till we figured out if she's working with Clyde, making troop positions. It's Murray, man. We can trust her. Besides, we already agreed we're gonna quit and go public with the evidence. What does it matter if we do one last mission? Come on, man. I can really use the cash. All right, Alice. When you go. You'll be heading to China. Sibu Mohammed is the terrorist mastermind who orchestrated the capture of the USS Constellation. He's the head of Abu Sayyaf and one of the most wanted men in the world. He's staying at the Jiangmin Hotel in the cliffs overlooking the Lijiang River. He's extremely well guarded, so you won't be able to get close to him. He's dead. Your instructions are to destroy this bridge as his convoy passes over it in the morning. If Muhammad's bodyguards pursue you, head down river and radio for extraction once you've lost them. Everything clear? Yeah. Yeah. What the hell are you guys doing in South Korea anyway? Just helping out an old friend. 